everybody, Hoodie Cobra Commander 788 here, and this is a quick look at Gung Ho version 5, the Mega Marines Gung Ho from 1993. This was part of the Mega Marines sub team, and just look at it. This figure is wild. Look at the colors. There is some nice sculpting on this figure, but it may get a little bit lost in the color choices. It is really outrageous. The Mega Marines sub team is probably one that you either loved or hated. There's probably not a lot of middle ground there. I do have to say Gung Ho is one of my favorite action figures. I loved version 1 of Gung Ho. I thought version 2 of Gung Ho was pretty good too. But it's really hard for me to accept Gung Ho in a uniform like this. This is not a full review. When I do review this figure I will have some positive things to say about it. Probably more negative things than positive things. But uh, there are some good things about it that I can find. The figure came with an orange helmet and a black accessory tree and an orange rocket launcher. Uh, those were pretty common in these 1990s figures. But then the other accessories get even crazier. This piece is a mold for the moldable bio armor, and we really need to talk about that. The moldable bio armor was this stuff, and this stuff was Play Doh. They could call it whatever they wanted to, but it was Play Doh. What you were meant to do is take the Play Doh and put it on the figure and use the mold to mold armor onto the figure. That was the moldable bio armor. Now obviously I'm not going to be a big fan of this figure, but when I found it I had to get it because this canister of moldable bio armor was sealed. It had never been opened. What is inside here is 24 year old Play-Doh and I just had to know what 24 year old Play-Doh looks like. It is not a pretty sight I have to tell you. So would you like like to see what 24 year old Play-Doh looks like? Would you like to see? Well, you're not going to see it right now. I'm not going to open it yet. I will open this for the full review someday in the future, but for now, you'll just have to uh, speculate and ponder about what 24 year old Play-Doh might look like. I can tell you though, it doesn't look anything like Play-Doh anymore. That was my quick review of the 1993 Mega Marines Gung Ho. I have a new full review coming up this Sunday. I hope you'll stick around for that. Thank you for watching this and thank you for watching all of my videos. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel so you don't miss any of them. I'll see you next time.